hello everyone you are welcome back to mass explorer in this video i'm going to solve and find the value of this interesting simplification math problem without using a calculator and without any standard multiplication in the rough work so how can we solve this cubic exponential math problem here first of all we will factorize this one number so therefore we can write this number this equation is we can write this 900 as 450 times 2 which is 900 whole cube minus 450 cube then in this one number we will use an exponential identity a times b whole raised to power n so here in this number we will use this one exponential identity a times b whole raised to power n which can also be written as a raised to power n times b raised to power n so using this identity here this number will become 450 whole cube times 2 cube minus 450 cube now look at to both terms in both the terms 450 cube is common so we'll take out common from both the terms so this will become 450 cube here only 2 cube is left minus here only 1 is left now let's simplify these two numbers so this will become 450 whole cube times here 2 cube is simply 2 times 2 is 4 4 times 2 is 8 so this is simply 8 minus 1 no 8 minus 1 is simply 7 so this will become 450 whole cube times 7 now we can write this number as 7 times 450 cube here we will try to find out this value without using a calculator and without any rough work so how can we calculate this value so we will calculate this value here first we will write the 7 so this becomes 7 times and here we can write this number as the sum of 400 plus 50 which is 450 whole cube now here in this one number we will use cubic algebraic identity a plus b whole cube identity and we will find out this value so here in this one number in this one step we will use this one cubic identity a plus b whole cube is equal to a cube plus b cube plus 3 times a b times a plus b so using this cubic identity here our a is 400 and b is 50 so this number will become 7 times now this is a cube so a is 400 so this will become 400 cube plus b cube b is 50 so this will become 50 cube plus 3 times a b you know a is 400 times b is 50 so this will become 50 times a plus b now a is 400 plus b is 50 braces close now here we will find out and simplify these numbers so this will become 7 times braces often so first we will find out the value of 400 cube so what is the value of 400 cube here 4 cube is 4 times 4 is 16 16 times 4 is 64 so 4 cube is 64 and there are two zeros so taking cube over two zeros this zero will become three times so there will be six zero so this will become 64 million first now what is five cube five cube is simply 125 and there is one zero so we will write this zero three times so this will become 125,000 plus now here we multiply these three numbers so first we multiply these two numbers we will write three as the same so this will become three times let's multiply these two numbers 50 times 0 is 0, 50 times 0 is 0, and 50 times 4 is 200. So this will become 20,000. And we will write this number as the same 400 plus 50. Parenthesis is close, this is close. And this will multiply these two numbers and then multiply the result with 450. So this will become 7 times. Here we will add these two numbers. So now to add these two numbers, we will start from the ones position. So adding 
these three zeros to these three zeros will become three zeros so our next is 125 so we'll add these three digits to these three this will become 125 and next is 64 so the addition of these two number gives him 64 million 125 thousand plus now let's multiply these two numbers so three times zero is zero 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 three times two is six so the product of these two number gives him 60,000. Now we multiply 60,000 with these two numbers with 450. So let's multiply 400 with 60,000. So this will become times 400 plus. We will also multiply this number with 50. So this will become 60,000 times 50. Now we will simplify these numbers. So this will become 7 times this number will be the same 64 million 125 thousand plus now let's multiply these two numbers so this is very simple 400 times 0 is 0 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 400 times 6 is 6 times 0 is 0 6 times 0 is 0 and 6 times 4 is 24 so here the product of these two numbers gives him 24 million plus let's multiply these two numbers so again we'll start from the ones position 50 times 0 is 0 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 50 times 6 is 6 times 0 is 0 and 6 times 5 is 30 so this will become 3 million so here the product of these two numbers gives us 3 million now here finally we will add all of these three numbers and then we will multiply the result with 7 now to add these three numbers we will start from the ones position so 0 plus 0 plus 0 is 0 0 plus 0 plus 0 is again 0 next is also 0 in all the places now next 0 plus 0 plus 5 is simply 5 0 plus 0 plus 2 is 2 0 plus 0 plus 1 is 1 now come to the median place digit so 3 plus 4 is 7 7 plus 4 is 11, so this will become 1. 1 will be carried to the next digit. 2 plus 1 is 3. 3 plus 6 is 9. So here the sum of these three numbers gives him 91,125,000 times 7. So here we multiply 7 with this number. So again, this is very simple. Now to multiply 7 with this number, we will start from the 1's position. So let's start from the 1's position and multiply 7 with this number. So 7 times 0 is 0. 7 times 0 is 0, 7 times 0 is 0, 7 times 5 is 35, so 5, 3 will be carried, 7 times 2 is 14, 14 plus 3 is 17, so 7, 1 will be carried, 7 times 1 is 7, 7 plus 1 is 8, so this will become 8, 7 times 1 is 7, and 7 times 9 is 63, so this will become 63. So here the product of these two numbers gives him 637,875,000. So finally, 637,875,000 is our answer and value of this interesting exponential simplification math problem. Now, in last, if you like this video, so don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel for such a more interesting and step-by-step -step math videos. Thanks for watching.